We at DreamCon right now. You can find the words before we get started? Oh, okay, we're going to get With the Phil? one and only Duke, bro. It was this kid calling him a loser, bro. He was not happy. Yeah, he was trying, man. Look, bro. <laughs> he like stop calling me losers and shit, bro. I don't care what you call me a loser. Hey, good dude. Hey, good dude. It's great to meet you, bro. Yeah. Keep going, bro. I don't Thank you, bro. I need con day two with the homie. <laughs> What's up, you guys? Rocky here. I got my boy Desmond from RDC World. My question for you is, what is your favorite film that you did from RDC World? Favorite film? That's a good question. I'll say Anime House. Which one? Or just in the general? The one we're making right now. Really? Yeah, the one we're making right now. It's my favorite one. Thank you so much for answering this question. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Anime House 6 is coming out, man. That, the anime show on that to be crazy. The first one done like me. Yes, sir. You got, I got the voice actor of Hulk right here from My Hero Academia. Hey, uh, what's up? This is Cox from My Hero Academia. Rocky Graham. Keep doing what you're doing, brother. Hey, proud of you. Keep going. Thank you so much. Uh, so, yeah, second day of DreamCon. Enjoying myself. I picked up some stuff. I'm way towards the end to show you guys that and my overall thoughts of DreamCon because this is my first year. I met a lot of familiar faces, so definitely will be showing that stuff off. What's up, you guys? I'm just chilling right now in the lobby. Just walking a lot. Needed to rest a little bit, but I can show you one thing that I'm really excited to show you guys. You guys do know I love Dragon Ball Z, so check this out. Let me drive it real quick. There's another artwork behind that one, but it's like sealed closed. So when I open it, I'll show you guys that as well. Like I said, I got some more stuff. Give me one second, it's in my pocket. Sorry guys, wrong camera. I got some Dragon Ball Z trading card packs and we're gonna open them. All right, you guys, so I got these trading cards right here. We're gonna see what each one got. So doing this one first. Goku. Oh shoot. That's a yeah. This is definitely the best one so far. I love Trunks, so this one go hard. Bear yeah, you guys, these are all the Dragon Ball Z cards I got. Got that boy Mark right here. Yeah, what's up, baby? Mark, the one and only Mark, bro. What's up, y'all? Day three of DreamCon. We got to get ready, but the squad playing Storm 4. But after that, we're going to be going to DreamCon the last day, so let's enjoy it. All right, you guys. We're at DreamCon, last day. We're going to enjoy this one, you guys. Let's 
Para o menor de si, tá chato Dreamcom merch. What's up, you guys? We're here with the one and only Jerry. So, you want to tell us about your merch? Stream Room. It's best. Merch and Dreamcom. Okay. So, my question for you is what made you want to start making merch? Passion. Passion. I love, love what I do. That's simple. Where can they find you? All platforms, Street Room. Just type in Street Room. On all platforms. I'll pop up. I'll be sure to tag it, but here goes some of his merch right here. Just give me some <laughs> Uh, yeah, I got my friend here, Lena Goddess, rocking her, her husband's here. You know, Gojo. Are you Shade's husband? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so we're having fun at DreamCon so far. So we're on the third day. This is my brother, Ryan. First Big time Ryan. at DreamCon. So what do you think, bro? You enjoying yourself? Bro, honestly, I wasn't supposed to come here, right? but I've been having the time of my life. This weekend has been lit. I done made a couple of my little fitness inspirations. I done made TikTok crunches and all types of stuff. <laughs> Like, fun people like that, you know what I'm saying? So, it, it's been a good time. It's been a good time. Yeah. with my boy. Yes, sir. So, yeah, I'm having a good time. Yeah, we're having fun. As you can see, there's still a lot of people here. We're having the time of our lives. Okay, so we just saw some members from RDC. Having fun, third day. What's up, bro? You good? So, we having fun so far. Definitely a great experience. Definitely go coming next year. I'm coming next year for sure. But... Let's see what else they got in store for us on the last day of DreamCon. You look great, man. No, no, I saw your, uh, I saw your thing last night on your story yeah. saying what was that show, man? Yeah, this is What's up, brother? Let you know your, um, your Instagram and TikTok. Yes, sir. Jennings Brower on all platforms. Yep. I'll put it on down here for you guys to see. But, yeah, look at your vocal card. It's amazing. We're ready to go. Listen, hey, Amazon's good to us, man. Yeah, yeah. Amazon's good with it with the cosplays. <laughs> Alright, so Spike, what's up, man? The main question for today is What is the most iconic anime scene ever? Okay, nah, yeah, yeah, nah, that, that was so gas. I'm not even gonna hold you. That's probably, like, it's, it's, it's definitely up there for me. It is so up there for me. I haven't seen that in so long. Nah, that one, that one might be better. Yeah, I think it's better than Super Saiyan. It might be better than Super Saiyan. I, I, well, thank you, bro. Yes, sir. So what made you want to do a YouTube and make speech and talk about Dragon Ball Z and all that? Funny thing is, I didn't even want to do YouTube at first. When I first started on Facebook, I was just focused on like, the fact that I have an audience, that I didn't care about monetization, I didn't care about spreading it, I just cared about the fact that I'm enjoying doing it on Facebook. Then all of a sudden I got to YouTube later, but it took 
like I just kept coming up with a whole bunch of random jokes, like you know what I'm saying, with like about anime and stuff. But people was like, you know, you should review anime, and I didn't even know what that was. I started looking up other people doing it. I'm like, yo, what's this? Next thing I know, I just started doing it because I know I was passionate about it anyway. So. Okay, that's what's up. Well, y'all go check him out. If you want to check me out YouTube? Nah, thank y'all, man. Hey, I appreciate it if y'all go check me out. Dave Marlowe, All right, thank you so much. I appreciate Fucking history is made, bro. How do you feel right now, bro? Feel good. The whole RDC world got to Oh, you missed everybody, bro. Glad you feel, bro. How do you feel? RDC world got your stuff, my guy. Yes, sir. Lou, how you feel? They got your stuff, my guy. Yes, sir. Straight W's. Street realm. Street realm. Street realm. Take that for Yeah. All right, you guys, that's a wrap. We're about to go to the final DreamCon event. That boy Jay right there, RDC bought his merch. That is crazy. But yeah, we'll catch you guys later. What's up, you guys? So um, DreamCon is officially over. Today is Monday. And um, I just woke up, as you can tell. But I'm going to show you the things that i've got and my overall thoughts of dream con so let's get into it so first off i got this rdc hat and i got this dream con hat um i don't know what type of hat you'll call these but i like the style of it i like how it looks so i definitely had to get two of them because i wear a lot of black but this one has white in it so it goes perfectly when i have black and white stuff um i got this free poster that they were handing out yesterday for the last day but as you can see it's the RDC Dream Con poster which I really love I'm gonna put that on my wall for sure and um you guys know that I am a Dragon Ball fan so I'll, you know they make these cool card stickers and I saw it and I had to get it so it turns as you can see I hope you can see it but is UI Goku in the hair. So yeah, I think this is really cool. This is definitely going on my car. I love it. And um, next up for the art, I have Goku and Vegeta right here. So think about this is, somebody actually did this and uh, I'm gonna put their Instagram down here, right here. But um, you should definitely check them out. They also did this. So yeah, those are the things that I've got at DreamCon. And I love every, I love every single thing that I've got. But as far as my overall thoughts at DreamCon, this is my first year and I gotta say it was a great experience. I loved every second of it. The RDC World and the Easy Gang. Um, I hope I said their name right. I'm not really too familiar with them. I know Burleazy and I'm Dante, that's about it. But um, both of those squads got my best friend, uh, J.R. Sims Merchandise Street Realm. And so I think that was very cool. Um, so his merch is known now because RDC and Easy Gang have it. Um, Burleazy has it. Uh, there's a couple, King Raider has it too. Um, that was one of the best parts of this weekend. But I will say it was just cool being able to take pictures and meet Mark, Desmond, Leland, and, and um, Dylan, I think I said Dylan already. But um, especially Mark, that dude is a big inspiration for me. I wasn't able to meet Ben, but I got the majority of the RDC World Gang, and you will see the pictures either before or after this. But um, I met and took a picture with King Vader, Caleb City, um, a couple of other people. I'm just still waking up, so I can't remember the names by heart, but I'll definitely be able to tag them when the pictures pop up in this video. But um, DreamCon was such an inspiration. So it just made me want to work harder on YouTube. And I think this is going to be my main focus, this and my music. So um, yeah, DreamCon was amazing. Um, it was it was so fun. Um, I enjoyed this week with my best friends, my brothers. Um, I wouldn't have wanted to spend it with anybody else but them. But um, 
Here's to next year's DreamCon. I'm definitely going to that one. And I will be known next year for sure. But um, that's all for this video. This is the first vlog. Be ready for more videos in the future. Rocky out.